Take my time with you. Till I get up, time is barely on our side. I don't wanna waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us, and love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah, no, I don't wanna waste what's left. And on and on we'll go through the wastelands, through the highways, to my shadow. Kids screaming in the 
Kids screaming in the cradles, profanities. Some days I feel skinnier than all the other days. Some days I can't tell if my body belongs to me. I love everything. Fire spreading all around my room. My world's so bright, it's hard to breathe, but that's alright.
I just can't let you go. Lord knows that I've tried to. You said I was the only one. No one likes being lied to. You made this mess and left me with the pieces. Now I wanna burn all the bridges between us.
know what? You're right. That was a, that was a, you're right, Jenny. I should be clean. Okay, you're correct. You are correct, sir. Why are these matches with me today? They fucking hate me today. Really? And she found the squirrel. Fuck! And she found the squirrel. <laughs> Fuck! Fucker. she says boof when she growls and or barks like she goes like watch hang on <laughs> watch i'll get her to do it excuse me she's too fixated hang on <laughs> oh. yo Top 10 anime betrayals of all time. What the fuck? Space! Tarek, thank you so much for the resub. Happy New Year, Penny Binks, essentially. You are doing so so. I believe everyone is also doing so so. So you're not the only one, but thank you so much for being here and for resubbing for 10 months, Tarek. Tarek, I feel like I've known you so much longer. Hi, Picasso. Hi, Sai. How are you? You don't swipe the matches, you pinch it. We all have our own ways, okay, Danny, okay? <laughs> hi, Slimy. Hi, OG Kill Shot. I hope you're doing well, too. You've known me long enough. Wow, that is rude. But look at, look at the glow up. Are you fucking kidding me right now? Just look, look at this room. Now that I have this mirror. I threw it. I don't know. I don't, I don't, I threw, I threw it. So that's on you. Um, 
but this is like literally I'm never gonna leave now. It's great. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Correct, my dog kind of looks like a cat. Is she part of the cat club? Because you never actually answered the question. I think I'd asked you this, but then you never actually responded. Um, so because Binks is named after and looks part cat, is she actually part of the cat house or no? Just these are questions I need to know, you know. <laughs> yes, I enabled cat jam and a bunch of other fucking things for you animals. <laughs> she is genetically unable to be in the cat club. Wow, Binks. I'm sorry, baby. Right now, does that pole hold up the ceiling? Yes. I actually took it out of my old apartment, so now the old apartment has caved in. <laughs> but I used it for this one, so now it's all good. Don't worry. It's fine. As long as I live here, the house will stand. <laughs> Alright, so. Let's, um... Dude, I am so sick to fucking death of 99.9% .9 of DMCA music. And I need to like sound the alarm and get people to send me more of their music because then my friends I just have like on repeat. And if you hear Binks barking, by the way, she's barking in the window at the reflection of the moon because she doesn't know what it is. Just letting you know. Anyway, um, so yeah, six of fucking death of it. So that means that this yoga stretch session we're about to do, we are going to do to one of my favorite playlists, which is the World of Warcraft calm music. It's on Spotify. It's a public playlist for anybody to use, and I use it all the time. Um, and so we're going to literally do yoga to the World of Warcraft soundtrack, because why the fuck not? And I'm pretty sure that's okay. So... <laughs> no, it's not nailed, and of course not. Thank you, Meats. I love the content, too. Fit check. Oh my god, we haven't booty up yet. Oh man, hang on, hang on, hang on. I haven't done this in so long. Yeah, booty up. Um, fit check. I just have on my black attire today. It's just black, black top, black shorts. You know, all the good shit. But look at the mirror. So okay, so like I said, yoga to World of Warcraft music. Incense. What else do we need before we start? Um, we've been together in the
brightness on here was down. Excuse me. Let me turn that. Oh yeah, way better. <laughs> I love this playlist like better. <laughs> I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. Who's joining me today? Light Feather, you were on like a yoga kick in my old place and then crazy shit happened. I don't know who is actually still even involved, like learning or participating, but I would love to get that started again and actually have a good group. Amazing. Okay, good. So I'm going to keep the music on and still talk us through it. If at any point it's too loud, can somebody please let me know? Like the music if you can't hear me. If not, I'd like to keep it as loud as possible for the vibes. Cool. Okay, can I help you? Okay, thank you. Thank you. You could be around. Just it's fine. It's fine. She's part of it now, it's fine. Okay, um, we're gonna start in half froggy. So left leg out, right leg in. Yay, hypers for the fucking tattoo, I'm so excited. Okay, so left leg out, you're gonna flex your foot. Right knee, right leg in. Grab your left foot and stretch. Yeah, please post it on Discord. Yes, we do yoga first and kill the dragon. <laughs> Hello, math man. Point your foot and flex. And point and flex. Point. Flex. I know all the good ones are always booked out or whatever. That's awful. Booked out, or they live in Berlin or something. Okay, bounce forward. Face your leg, left hand on either side. Up and over. <laughs> it's okay, I don't mind if you don't message if you're following along. You should actually, I mean, most of the time, unless you're like me and you can reach over right now to your laptop, most of the time you should just be, you know, doing it. Switch legs, left in, right out. Yeah, flawlessly, I'm sure. Flex your right foot. Oh, yeah, shit, sorry. Uh, <laughs> um, I, they still have yet to really have a fucking yoga category. And if they do, it sucks, so... Um, can you put it in fitness fun? Yeah, yeah, put it in fitness, yeah. You're too drunk to do- you're drunk right now? <laughs> I kind of love that. <laughs> should I drink red wine while I'm doing this? I should, shouldn't I? I made it my thing to make a- have a glass of red wine. Every single night. Drink ever player. You know what? Yep, I'm gonna go pour myself a glass of red wine. Excuse me. Hang on. Hello, 
that guy. Hi, solicited. <laughs> you can, listen, you can drink and you can smoke whilst, whilst doing yoga, thank you. No, dogs like feed me. I'm drinking it out of my Lord Kirk mug that someone got it for me, so thank you. Thank you, that guy. All right, so light feather, point, flex. I'm addressing you because I know you're doing it. Point and flex. And yes, men should point and flex. I don't know why everyone thinks it's a dancer thing. It is a stretch your body thing. So you should point and flex. And bounce in the middle, and there's Barb. Barb, come stretch with me. I'm gonna spit all the way. You what? Still done playing World of Warcraft music. I'm enticing you. Stop. <laughs> it's your leg, left hand on the side, right on the other. I mean. We're not really meditating right now, we're just stretching, so. Grab your right foot, left arm comes up and over. Massimo, I have a lot of tattoos. I'm just gonna post them in the Discord, I believe, because everyone always asks me, and I think I did it a long time ago, but I should really pin it or something. I'll pin it to the sub only section. I'm not gonna lie, I was feeling super uninspired about my mirror. Because it's so hard to like, you know, get better at things and whatever if you're not in front of a mirror kind of critiquing yourself. And now I'm like full force happy again. Okay, if you can reach down to touch your elbows, you can go on the ground, but don't make it have to straighten your back. Your pelvis should be on the ground evenly with your hip bones. You shouldn't be like lean back or anything. It should be flat on the ground. Your gooch and your bad should be kissing the ground, okay? If it's tilted back, you're not doing it right. Anyway, from there, you're gonna go down. If you feel it in your back, you're doing it wrong. So you can put your arms behind here and push. You can keep one hand in front and push. Keep your back straight and just go down as much as you can. You'll feel it right here. And if you can, go down, but don't put any tension in your back. Okay, right leg comes in. We're gonna do butterflies, the feet together. Knees out. You can bounce your knees like you're flying away. I'm so proud of everyone for doing this, like I know you are. <laughs> Hi Sharks fan, how are you? You have all of your ex's names tattooed. <laughs> oh my god. You're actually a liar, because I've seen photos of you, so you're lying. So don't lie. In your mindscape. I like how everyone thinks now that they can fucking win me over by saying some spiritual shit, because they know all about it. They're like, don't worry, Angelique, my mind's game. Because <laughs> Reza knows I'm into it. He's like, yeah, it's fine. I'm just going to say like words that sound really fucking cool. And she'll believe me. <laughs> what is the question, Sharks fan? Ms. Tick, hello. NZL, welcome. Oh, if you can at this point, push your knees down with your hands. As far as you can go without, I, I know it hurts, just hold it. Hold it and breathe, breathe, breathe. In through your nose, out through your mouth. You can ask that. Um, I have had my belly button pierced since I was 15. God, when I say things like that, it's like the, it's like when people ask me, like, what age did you start drinking? What age did you lose your virginity? What age did you start getting like pierced? Like, I feel like such a delinquent compared to most people I meet. Zach Digital! <laughs> I can't do I could do a I could do some sort of roll. You wanna see it? I could do this. The 
Did that count? I did it to World of Warcraft music, so it counted for extra. <laughs> Thank you. That wasn't part of the yoga, please don't do that. <laughs> Zach, when are you coming over to do yoga with me, Zach? I know you're fucking tense. I can tell. Your aura is tense. You need to come and look at my fucking mirror. Ignore that. Look at that. Are you kidding me? People always ask those questions, of course. And thank you for the bits. I appreciate that. I cannot do a backflip, but I am working on it so that one day I can just surprise you guys and just fucking. Yes, please next week. Zach, yoga stream, hype. Ooh, 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 ooh. And, 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 and. If we hit the donut goal too, I'll rope him into me and Moon's outdoor workout stream. So not only will you get Zach doing yoga, but we'll do our workout stream and I'll have him fucking just 50 push-ups with one arm while holding a glass of water on his head. So. <laughs> I don't know why. Belly, but belly button rings are sexy. That's why my mom was so pissed when I got one really early. Yeah, I know. I just, I, I, I also saw that today that you can do. Yes, you can, Zach. Come on. The whole point of this pandemic is to emerge from our shell hotter than before. And let me tell you something. I am working on it. I am fucking thriving. Like, like internally. Not like outwardly, but like, I am. You're not fucking fat. They can't stop. You just have a simple one. I yes, I do. The whole point of a pandemic is to die. <laughs> the whole point of a panda uh, a life feather. Pull your pull your ankles out, and I'll make the big diamond. Grab your ankles, push down with your knees. Um, your hair is bigger. That's not. That's like New Jersey's version. That's not even a thing. If you got tanner or more muscular only in the upper body region and your hair got taller, you must be from New Jersey. We are eating healthy. We are <laughs> doing good things for ourselves and getting fit. <laughs> real big, car's real big, let me tell you how big. <laughs> oh my God, see, but that's, Oh, speaking of, um, okay, wait, hang on, let me move to my next one. Uh, Life Feather, we just did that. I would like to be, I'm addressing more people than just you, but hang on. Um, oh, we're gonna sit and do neck rolls, so do, um, do Half Lotus, left leg up. It's World of Warcraft music, we are vibing to World of Warcraft music tonight. I keep seeing something over there, if you keep seeing me look over there, it's really bugging me out, because... It's really bugging me out. It keeps looking like Moon's coming out of her room, but I know she's not, and it's really bugging me out. It looks like... never mind. Yeah, it is cloud music. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, you could, you could do that too. Alright, so, half lotus, shoulders relaxed. Hi, Fenya. Yeah, dude, the mirror's from my old place. Remember my old mirror? My old, my old apartment? This is... The mirror, I just got it installed today. Finally, after five, I'm sorry, we're trying to be zen. <clears throat> after five months of waiting patiently and being so elated to wait and, and work on my patience in this pandemic, <clears throat> it has finally arrived. So I, I bless the uh, universe for allowing me to practice my patience, which was, in very much need of getting tested. Dude, wow is amazing. I love this fucking soundtrack. It's that cove. Oh, is it you guys? Oh yeah, you guys see it too. Oh my god. Because the the mirror is there. Totally forgot about that. Great. It took five months because the pandemic was not allowing people to fucking bring the mirror from point A to point B, which took a grand whopping total of about an hour and a half. The longest part of that was the installation, and that's only because they needed to chip off the old shit from the other one. Um, but yeah, five months because the same people who were doing everything else weren't allowed to bring a fucking mirror over here, but whatever. Here we are. Hi, Sebastian. I know it is. Okay, sorry. Uh, half Lotus. 
our neck, we're going to roll all the way down. Very loose, loosey goosey. And all the way back. And all the way down again. Thank you, Thenyo. And all the way back again. And we're gonna go all the way to the right side, trying to touch our ear to our shoulder, which is super loosey goosey. Right arm up and lay it on top of your head, pulling this down right here. You're gonna feel this pull. I have, I stumbled upon my notes from last year. And I'm really happy to say that I did two out of three things. I forgot what the other one was already, but, um, oh, no, 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 I remember now. <laughs> um, they were basically just body working. I promised myself that in 2020, my goals would be to see a chiropractor every single month and to get a body massage every month to keep up with my physique and shit. And I have been. I have my guru that I go see. My third one was to go to surf school, switch left arm up. And that didn't happen because of COVID, so sad stuff. Next year, well, this year, when shit's done, I'm going to enroll myself into surf school and start to get fucking weird. Well, more weird. I'm gonna be more weird. Inhale. Exhale. Roll all the way to the right. Zach, I need a mirror. I need a mirror. I'm gonna do shoulder rolls and yell. <laughs> Mirrors just help with things. To the left. Oh, sorry. Not no, not surf. Um, Cirque. Cirque, like circus school. Look forward. Look over our right, look over our left, our range of motion, right again, left again. Now we're actually going to, I can motivate myself, want to watch for 50 subs. What? Motivate, you're going to roll your shoulders. <laughs> we'll, we'll roll our shoulders right now all the way back <laughs> yeah do you follow along that's what I hope everyone's doing well a lot of people and roll forward right left high strider right left oh come on I can't motivate you via here and switch rolling it to the front Loosen them up, bounce them up and down. Roll them shoulders. Now we're gonna isolate our chest. We're gonna breathe in and push off everything to the front. I fucking hate zoom. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. We're gonna go left and right. Forward, left, back, right, easy. Back, right, circle, to the left. Am I streaming? Yes, I am. Oh my god, you have a mirror. Yes, the fuck is. I'm so sorry about my book. That's okay. Roxy, be careful, this camera. Reverse. Dude, I'm so happy, happy about the mirror. I'm so happy for you. It looks, I mean, it's only going to look totally different in a great way. It's, it's beautiful. beautiful. Like, I slept like 15 hours. Oh my god. I have no idea why. I didn't do anything. I just slept for 15 hours. I, even, I didn't even drink yesterday that much. I feel normal. I just don't know why. Like, my body says, no, we're not doing the morning thing. We're not morning people. Why? Why are we morning people? <laughs> don't, don't. Oh, Roxy, I love doing yoga in a while. <laughs> okay, arms. <laughs> Crota is drunk and he says you're wonderful. Almighty! Shot, 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 shot. <laughs> well, they can see me in the mirror right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Yep, welcome to the mirror. You cannot hide from the mirror. Oh my god. No. That would have been. Very bad. That would have been very bad. Okay, arms. Oh, 
go, arm stretches. Right arm in front, left arm comes up. <laughs> there she is. Switch. Keeping your shoulders low, remember. No tenseness in here. Right arm up, you're gonna to touch the palm. Oh, you can see me in the back right now, right? You're gonna to touch the middle of your back with your palm, pull your elbow. Oh my God, whatever sound that is, I fucking love it. Hello, Edson, how are you? Oh my God, fuck me up with those bagpipes, I love it. <laughs> Switch. Does anybody ever just like get super fucking like under mine? <laughs> Stretch your tricep. <laughs> thank you, group, for the resub for 15 months. Group, thank you. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> okay, left, right, <laughs> you better start believing in ghost stories, you're in one, <laughs> alright, sorry, stop it, different kind of music, Zachary, whatever you didn't say, I'm glad you didn't say it, <laughs> oh my god, Okay, uh, we're gonna stretch out our palms. Stretch our palms. Um, boys, you should really be doing this one. You should really do this if you do pull or if you touch a pole often. You know, like, guys, I'm just saying, it helps release the tension. So you should stretch out your palm. <laughs> if you use your hand often, stretch it out. Okay, inhale, exhale, switch. <laughs> I love drunk all my <laughs> Such a pull, eh? I have a massage gun too, but stretching is also helpful, okay? Left arm, stretch. Oh my god. Switch. Roll your wrist to the right. Roll to the left. Oh my god, this part makes me cry. Oh. <laughs> Alright, everybody do backwards prayer hands, which you can now see in the mirror. Beautiful. Zachary, do this move right now and just loosen up your fucking shoulders. Dude, I've cried to this song, no shame. Literally shed tears to this song. Hey. Hey. What is that? What is that? Here we go. <laughs> You're not supposed to hear me. Yeah, okay, fine. I'll play WoW well later. No, I can't tonight. I can't. I can't tomorrow. I really can't tonight. I really want to. Uh, maybe, 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 maybe. I'm going to try to do full lotus though. <laughs> no. 
Aha! I get it. I did it. <laughs> I did it without touching my hands. Okay, anyway, sorry. Back to this. She waits for me to turn my back to talk shit. Hello. Hello, Jinx. How are you, babe? Stop it. How are you? Welcome. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. My animal's misbehaving right now. <laughs> she <laughs> She's trying to fit in with the World of Warcraft music playing right now. Oh my god. What do you want? Say to my face. Say to my face. Say to my face. Anyway, sorry, we're still trying to be calm. Okay. <laughs> um we're going to move into <laughs> she does do yoga with me sometimes. Hi, PSG. Yes, thank you. You too, babe. Um, please. Please, 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 come do yoga anytime. For nobody that knows, Strawberry Jinx is a wonderful ASM, ASM artist, ASMR artist, and I watch her almost every night. I fucking love ASMR to go to sleep to, and for some reason, like, it's just the thing that I really like. I don't know, it's a good thing that helps me go to sleep. And so I just always watch ASMR all the time. Like, every night I watch ASMR. Even if I'm not saying anything, I'm like up lurking and I'm just falling asleep. <laughs> Dude, it's so fucking good. It's so good. My thing though is like, I like the sounds, but I like the visuals. Like I'm really like, I like those hand things that people do. It fucks me up. I'm like, oh my God, I feel like I'm in a hypnotized like trance. But then they'll be like, okay, close your eyes. And I'm like, but then I can't see you do the hand things. And every time they're doing it, I want to fall asleep. But then when I close my eyes, I wake up because I'm no longer watching it. Does that make sense? Like, I almost wish my eyelids were thin enough <laughs> to go to sleep and still watch something. This is what happens when you stop smoking weed, by the way. Okay. <laughs> Zachary. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine. Oh god. It does not sound like Pocahontas. Stop it. And this is the Garden of Life. Okay. Everybody who's doing yoga, get on your knees, please. Thank you. Right leg up. We're gonna make sure that our look at my we're gonna make sure that our knees over our ankle. Hi Chewy. <laughs> oh my god, I want to. Hi Bo. <laughs> Breathe in. Exhale. 
to our right. Oh yeah, the Elder Scrolls would be good too. When you feel like you can balance, tuck in your toes and stretch out that leg. Rambo your band. Knee down, come stretch out that right leg. Oh, I miss Jimbaline. Where'd he ever go? It was only a Big Mac and some fries. It will take you, it would take you, you would have to run the length of a football field seven times just to work off a small McDonald's fry. FYI. Well, any of these poses you can do um, in beginner fashion. What I mean by... God. What I mean by that, somebody come take her. Come control your animal. She's not my animal, and she's being bad. Um, you can make any pose beginner by just not going extreme. Yeah, dude, I want to work on my splits too. That's exactly what I'm working on, actually. Hello. Hello, I love you. I love you too. Yes, I could see you. I don't like being broke. Can't say hi to me. Oh yeah. You <laughs> no no it's not me. <laughs> I don't know who that is. I can run two hundred football fields in ten minutes. You are lying. Oh That's my right. god. You should make a video of that and like become famous. <laughs> that is just so impressive. In fact, do you want my number? <laughs> you probably have your number, Zach. Zach? <laughs> <Did> you... <laughs> do you have my number? <laughs> He texts me, he texts me, he's like, hey. That was really oh, good. Yeah. I don't know who said what. I know, I love you, I'm crying. I love chat. Oh my god, that's good. <laughs> oh my god. That's so hard. Sweezy, hello, 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 hello. Okay, switch. Hey, no barking. If you hear a terrible so sonic scream, I'm sorry, Jess. My dog. No, 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 you didn't miss it, we're still doing that. Animal fucking Hi, I just woke up. Good to see you. <laughs> I have nobody's number. I deleted everyone, including myself. <laughs> Hi, Hagrid. Dude, why is everyone hammered tonight? I don't know what the deal is, but I'm, I just started drinking my red wine, so I'm about it. Everyone's hammered? I mean, it seems like everyone's been drinking. This is one of those Wednesdays, you know? Yeah, I get it. I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm for it. I'm here for it. <laughs> Breathe in. God, I'm so happy I have my fucking mirror. Back to the bathroom. Knee down, left leg stretch. Why are you sober when I'm not I'm drinking red wine out of my Lord Kirk mug, okay? Oh yeah, that too. Yes, hi Thank you, Rambo. Thank you, Rambo. Yeah, thank you. No, I, I had the place that installed it last time. Um, come, they redirected it. super bad. I know, isn't it amazing? Oh 
marching band. Okay, come up, we're going 
going to go into the mermaid, which is cool now because you can see me in the mirror and vice versa. So, <laughs> I'm so proud of you, Zach. <laughs> I know, right? Alright, so from where we're going to tuck our heel in and we're going to go up on our knees. And we're going to elongate that leg. We're going to bring that leg up and we're going to hook the foot into our elbow crease right there. You're going to find the center of your balance with your core. And then when you feel comfortable, you're going to bring your right arm up and around. You're going to hook it with your hand. Chaturanga, so we're going to bend. We're not going to touch the ground though, and when we're close, we're going to push up and tuck your toes under and let your back relax, your lower back relax. Push back up. We're going to look forward and jump with our feet together. Stretch your legs up straight, slowly roll up. Feels good, man. Feels fucking great, man. All right, now we're gonna do the other side. You can take some water now if you want to. Now is the time to drink water or wine, cheers. <laughs> I'm doing both right now. Okay, we're going to do left warrior, our left side warrior sequence. We're going to step out with our left foot, we're going to step back with our right, lunge position. So you always want your knee to be over your ankle, you don't want it too far and too back, you want it to be like stacked, like real nice. Water and coffee, yes. Mostly water and red wine for me tonight, but normally coffee. <laughs> so you should be feeling this build right here and stretch this out. Arms up, breathe in. Thank you, Chad Fish, for the reset. Welcome back, baby. How are you? Good to see you. Hello, I Ufu. <laughs> IDPM. Okay, so arms up. Breathe. When you can, put your knee down. And if you want to get crazy, you can bend your back a little bit. Yeah, it is hard to balance. So when your body is 
your body will shake and you're, you'll feel your muscles shake. So sometimes you feel really uneasy, but that just means they're working. So let them shake. It's okay. It means you're building. It means you're actually working that muscle. It's just like, what the fuck's going on? But all those little muscles, all those stabilizing muscles for balance, you don't really normally use them. So when they do get used, they're like, what the fuck, what the fuck? So now you're just training them. So from here, arms on the inside of your leg. Whenever you straighten your arms, try not to lock your, but keep them straight. Left foot turned out. The World of Warcraft music is getting intense. <laughs> this is becoming very intense yoga. If you are feeling flexible, you can move your left foot up. See how mine's just going up? You can move it up if you want to. It's not required, but if you feel the need and you can, you can. So, go, go crazy. And what's the same brand as this one? From here, tuck your toe under and straighten your leg. You're feeling comfy try to go down your elbows if you can't do this it's totally okay don't force yourself to stay up on your arms until i move again knee down back on your hands. You're going to kick your left leg back while you inhale. Go down to your forearms and push it over your head. You're going to kick over your head and hold this. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Exhale, pull it through into pigeon. A lot of people, no, don't feel bad. Every time. It's hard because this house is small and there's three of us, so feel bad. They feel bad. I always feel bad when I'm being loud for them, too. Um, dead pigeon. So basically with pigeon, what you don't want to happen is you don't want to feel like you're falling too much to the left or to the right. Um, that's why people usually have yoga blocks. I don't need them right now, but if you ever needed to, you can use them. Um, but you should, if you can't, Feel yourself get to a comfortable position here. Hold yourself up like this if you don't have yoga blocks. I have a little bit of gap just because it's been, you know, two days since I did this. But you don't want to sit here like this. You want to have the correct form. So your belly button should be over your knee and it should be making this A shape. And if you can't get there, you're going to hold yourself up. And then eventually you'll feel it slowly melt into that. Oh no, is it me or is it you? 
not like. Is it you or me? Am I lagging or is it you? Let me know. Okay. Harry Potter in the yoga class. All right, we're gonna keep our left foot in. Came out of pose to let you know. Oh, dude, thank you. <laughs> Okay, back in pose. <laughs> Thank you. I will return to pigeon pose for you. And now we're going to fluctuate into mermaid. So tuck leg under, roll up. Once you have that balance right here, pick your leg up. Sometimes it's easier to pick it up at first. <laughs> I am the dominatrix yoga teacher. Um, put your foot in your elbow crease. Find your balance with your core. Once you have this balance, you can bring your arm up to grasp around. So what I don't want you guys doing is I don't want you going behind your head and doing that weird strenuous reach thing, it's not good for you. You're framing your head. There should be no effort in your arms. It's all coming from your shoulder and your core. Put your left hand down at your own pace, keeping your right um, heel to your butt, and you're gonna fall forward. This is probably the most painful thing. Literally makes me want to die. And if you're doing it the right way, it will make you want to die as well. Like you're humping the floor. <laughs> it's really stretching this out, but this is really good for your splits. That's really. A lot of people think it's just hamstrings. Like no, it's this too. The better you have this, the more able you are to do your splits. So it fucking hurts, but just power through it. Put down, we're gonna go back into downward dog. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> That's a very fresh one, much love. Breathe in. Exhale to downward dog. You can pedal your legs while you're here if it's a little too tight for you, if you feel like you need to. And from here we're going to pick up our right leg and I inhale it up into the three-legged dog. Exhale, you bend it open if you want to, or you can keep it straight. Inhale it to your center of your chest. hands right here. We're going to use our forearms to push up into dolphin, which is basically downward dog, but with your forearms on the ground. 
So same kind of formation. So you can see. Fall forward into plank. Slowly touch your tummy down. Arms at your side, you're gonna push up into seal. Let your neck roll. Child's yoga to see how we're feeling. I read this thing where you can actually release like your body's own form of DMT into yourself, like naturally. So I want to try it with you if you're down. I'm super down to do it. It's a breathing technique that apparently releases DMT or a DMT like feeling into yourself. And um, yeah, let's go for it because bodies are fucking awesome. <laughs> so what it basically is, is we're going to, and deep inhale, deep, like deep, deep, deep. We're going to deeply inhale through our nose, out through our nose. Then in through our nose, out through our mouth. Then in through our mouth, out through our mouth. And repeat. So nose, 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 mouth, mouth, mouth. Repeat, nose, nose. And then every time you do it, you're supposed to quicken the pace. So let's do it for like, let's do it for 10 rounds. Let's get crazy and see how it feels. Yes, exactly, Pinky, okay? I'll talk you through it, ready? So close your eyes. They said if you start to feel tingling, that it's working. So run it. Okay, ready? In through your nose. Out through your nose. In through your nose. Out through your mouth. In through your mouth. Out through your mouth. Second time, in through your nose. Out through your nose. In through your nose. Out through your mouth. In through your mouth, out through your mouth. In through your nose, out nose. In nose, out mouth. Out uh, in mouth, out mouth. In nose, out nose. In nose, out mouth. In mouth, out mouth. In nose, out nose. In nose. Out mouth, in mouth, out mouth. Two more times. In nose, out nose, in nose, out mouth, in mouth, out mouth, in nose, out nose, in nose, out mouth, in mouth, out mouth. 
making myself crazy. <laughs> oh, it feels a little weird. I'm not going to lie. I do feel a little weird. I don't know if it's just the rush from breathing too much or what's good, but I kind of like, woo, feel a little tingly. Yeah. Ooh. It's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. I like that. I like that. I like that. Ooh. A little tingle. Very interesting. <laughs> very interesting. That was cool. That's very cool. I like that. Alright, dope. Then I guess the ultimate trip. Dude, really? That's amazing. Yes, Pinky. <laughs> Is it really? You trip when you are readily. Okay, well, cheers to that. I think you should create a nose. <laughs> nose, 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 mouth, mouth, mouth. What? Repeat. Alright, now we're going to do some oof, back bendies, back bendy stretches, okay? Back bendy stretches. Well, first of all, if you could do this, this is a good start, good quad stretch. Check out Wim, Wim Hof on YouTube. I will, thank you. <laughs> All right, so from here, pick our legs up. And down your backs. That's why you have to stretch your quads, solicited. That's why. This is why. All right. Pick up your knees. We're going to do thread the needle, so one leg stays out like on tabletop, the other one comes in front. I'm going to face this way so you guys can see what I'm doing. So you're going to push on your knee and pull on your right thigh. And switch. I know, I've been meditating every morning. It's fucking phenomenal. Grab your left knee in, where it like comes down. Rotate your left ankle to the left. Rotate to the right. Try to stretch it up if you can. You're going to take it from the left side to the right side. You live in Norway, so here it's minus four Celsius. And I walk with a... With, what the fuck? I read that and I thought you said you walk with a boner. I'm like, well, I'm really happy for you. <laughs> Switch legs. Right leg comes in, left leg out. Circle your right ankle to the right. Circle to the left. <laughs> I wouldn't know. My vagina knows no temperature. It just happens when it happens. If it floods down there and it's like the Titanic, then it's just because it's cold outside, but I can't really help the process. Right leg up. I have a pole, so I'm cheating, but you should be holding your leg. I'm going to cheat, though, because I can do what I want because it's my stream. So I'm cheating. You guys shouldn't cheat. you got to hold it. <laughs> Grab it, go to your left side. That actually hurts the worst, to be honest. Switching your, your leg to the left is fucking killer. It, this hurts so bad. <laughs> Knees up. Both up. Grab an open. I'm cheating again.
stir, hello. Okay, so for those in chat who are able to do a bridge, we're going to do a bridge. If you're not able to do a bridge, that's completely okay. This is um, more intermediate. You can try it if you'd like to, but if you don't want to, that's fine. So what we're going to do is we're going to put our arms behind us. And when you, you want to breathe in, and when you exhale, you're going to push yourself up with your arms and your legs, and you're going to make a beautiful bridge. And if you feel really spicy, you can walk it in and make a wheel, tighter bridge. If you're feeling spicy, you can point your fucking toes and do releve. And if you're feeling extra saucy, you can lift a leg, alternate legs. We're going to do all three. Cool? <laughs> Breathe in. Exhale. You don't lock your wrists. You actually bend your fingers at that little bend right there, and you press your weight into the pads of your fingers and the palm. You don't just lock your wrists. You press. You're constantly pressing. Yoga is constantly about pushing and moving. And even if you're standing still, you're still pressing into the earth with the, you know, the sole of your foot. You're pressing with your palm. You're constantly in motion, even if it's a still kind of motion. You know what I mean? So you're never just like, you know. Dude, that's totally okay. That's why I like to do it. <laughs> I used to have people that, I, I had a bunch of different people circulate through my stream and stuff, people that genuinely cared about it and stuff. I, I, although I do agree with you that Twitch is not for certain platforms. Like, you, I, I mean, you guys already know my thoughts. I've talked about it already. But there's just certain things that I don't think Twitch is right for. Like more serious things. Yoga is about as serious as I'll get. And it's only because I fucking love stretching. And even when I do yoga on here, it's not really like it's not really it's not really like my my genuine yoga sessions when it's all like super mental, spiritual and shit. It's more of just stretching and showing you guys and stuff, but that's not Twitch is more like, you know, shit posting and goofing around and stuff, in my opinion. <laughs> um, okay, so we're going to do backward snail now. Oh, good. Good night, Pinky. Thank you for coming in here. Fucking right, we can. <laughs> yeah, fire's at the core. Exactly. And my core needs fire because my core is fucking weak sauce right now. Weak sauce. Okay, so backwards now. If you can't use your core strength, your wrist. So even when you do a bridge like you just did, you're pressing with your palms, fingers, not, yes, I'm pressing constantly with my palm. Yeah, of course you'll feel a little bit, but you should be relying on that. You should be locking your wrists. Okay, so if you want to, uh, you don't need to use your abs to get up. You can use, like, put your butt in your hands like this. Like you're serving your ass on a platter. Like, hello, sir. Okay, 
but you know, right here. <laughs> and then from here you can push yourself up, get really straight. And then when you can, music got really intense there. I felt like I had to roll up and just like... <laughs> Fuck yeah. Hi, name. Name. Hello, acid souls. Poggers, poggers, poggers. <laughs> you feel like a plane? Is there anybody in the chat? that wants to do a more intermediate, I'm sorry, I lied. Do you want to do a more expert um, bridge type situation? Fuck yeah, I can't ask it, soul. Fucking let me know right now, because I will. Let me know. I'll, go, I'll reverse and do it again. <laughs> can't even do that. Oh, like that. Is your, is, is your, are you tight? Is there anybody in the chat that can and wants to do a little bit harder, harder version? If you're not able to, it's totally cool. I'm just wondering. Because the, the forearm bridge is harder. Way harder. Totally okay. Totally fine. Totally fine. Yes, please. I kind of need to be more flexible, I think. Let's do Bo, if you're not going to do it with me, I'm not doing it. <laughs> I want to do it with somebody, not for, I mean, I can do it for you, but full, no, are you going to do it with me, Bo, or what's good? Oh, I said, um, I said, uh, do you guys want to do a harder version of the bridge? I'll attempt anything once. I am doing it. Okay, Acid, I'm going to do this, and then I will do that for you. So for this one... I've done this before for some for you guys. You'll 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 know. You'll know when you see it. But it's it's the forearm bridge. So it's a little bit fucking harder. If you ask it, if you have I cannot stress this enough. If you have not stretched out, do not just jump into this. It could be big out, okay? Big fucking out, big pull muscle, big out. So maybe like do a few do a few fucking warm-ups first, okay? Uh alright, so the chest, um, the okay. <laughs> You know what? Your fucking body. <laughs> I am I am so not here for the Twitch disclaimer. Alright, so uh, instead of going onto your, your uh, hands for the bridge, what we're going to do is roll onto our forearms. So you're literally going to roll your body back a little further onto your forearms, and then push up into a bridge with your forearms, okay? And then if you want to get fucking crazy again, you can lift one leg, go on your toes, whatever. Um, okay. I dance. It does help, actually, yes. <laughs> <laughs> that dancing 100% helps. If you're warmed up a little bit, it would be better, but... Okay. Okay, here we go. Okay. You can also look at... I don't know if the mirror is helping with this angle, but... Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna really dip your arm back there, because we're gonna go up on our... My issue is my hair always gets stuck under my arm. Long hair problems. Alright, so from here, ready? Push up onto the forearms, and walk your legs up. And boom. You wanna get crazy? Lots of core. 
Not me. <laughs> no, it's totally fine. Totally, totally, totally fine. Don't worry about it. You got up? Okay, I was good till you were full tripod. <laughs> Dude, at least you tried. It is, it is. It's a lot a lot of the pro so a lot of the times guys you'll have a harder issue with that one because you I'm generalizing here, but the point is, is that mostly guys work on their chest more so than women and their arms. So your shoulders, your pecs right here, this is all super tight. So for you to be able to do that, you really need to overstretch the areas that you work out the most. Like for me, it's my butt and my legs, which is why I can't fucking get my splits down because I constantly am working them out and building them. So I have to stretch extra. So you guys have to stretch extra your chest openers, you know, your, your shoulders, etc. So make sure you're always doing that. Is it normal if I'm <laughs> Can we do something to stretch the chest? Yes, we can. Yeah, your chest, the, the chest is, chest is really hard. Also the bridge poses and all that jazz, very easy. So probably one of the best ones for your chest is um, bow pose. Cool cobra and bow pose. We'll do, um, and cam. You know what, we'll do a camel. You really, we're gonna do camel again. So when you're doing camel, you're going to reach, your, your pelvis is pushing forward. So you're really accentuating that shape. You're not gonna like go back with it, you're pushing it forward to keep your hips stacked over your knees. You're gonna grab your ankle, grab your other ankle, and push up. The entire time, remember, yoga is constantly in motion. You're gonna feel like this, this thing is pulling your chest up. So you're constantly like pushing, you're pushing your chest up to the sky while simultaneously relaxing your neck and breathing. That's a really good one, okay? Yay for the vibes! So that's a really good one to do for chest. Um, another really good one to do for chest is going to be the bow pose. Um, it's also for your, your shoulders too besides puppy dog, which we've done. So for bow pose, I want you to get down on your stomach. You can't really, <laughs> later. <laughs> okay, so everybody who is doing bow pose, get down on your stomach. Drink some wine. I really thought about when I get my yoga teaching certificate, having like wine and yoga nights. However, I feel like when I do that, everyone's just going to fall over. <laughs> like I just picture a room full of people getting hammered and doing incorrect poses. And then I'm gonna be liable for that. And I don't wanna be liable for that. So um, <laughs> yeah, no, no wine and yoga. Okay, anyway, everyone on their belly. <laughs> Oh wait, I'm sorry, hang on real quick. I gotta do a big fucking pog for Luder, who I don't remember when he upgraded to these, to the fucking, the, the garters, but he got the fucking garters for being a three year subscriber. So his booty has the thong, if you mouse over the sub badge, he has the thong with the garters and the stockings now. Ah, Condi has a skirt, Condi has a short skirt, yay. <laughs> and Solicita has the jean shorts. <laughs> I love it. Oh my god. Fuck yes. Beautiful, beautiful. I wish it would just tell you three years because you know I'm bad at math and I just made, I just realized that 36 is three years. <laughs> anyway, okay. On our stomachs, <clears throat> legs up. Grab the outside of your feet. This already, you should be feeling it. Already here, you should feel it. And then what you're going to do is inhale. You're going to exhale. Pushing up. You're going to be lifting up your thighs. You're constantly pushing your feet into your hands. Right now, what is in motion is my feet are pushing into my hands. My legs are lifting off the ground. My chest is held high. Your knees are staying together. You are breathing. It is hard as fuck, but you are breathing. And you're relaxing. Whew. 
as a good stretch. That was a good stretch. Oh, my legs up. Good stuff. Yeah, that's a good one, right? Oh man, that was good. That was good. I just re subbed to the first guy I'm subbed to for 65 months. Holy hell. That's fucking dedication. I know it really it, it really means a lot because I don't know, real real talk, like it's it's always hard because like I love streaming on Twitch. Like I really do. And after three years of doing it, I still really, really love it. But it is hard because there is that certain level of dedication and you really like for people to really become big and grow, they really stay at it like almost seven days a week, live every single day at the same time, fucking hours on end grinding. And it's not that I don't want to put into the work, it's just like I constantly have that dual personality where like I'm just like a huge hippie, guys. Like you know that, I just am. And so as much as I love the internet world and like you know how it's my job, it's also like a big part of me is always like, okay, but I still want to like explore and I want to go spend time with my family. I don't want to be so connected to social media or whatever because I feel like it does take a toll on your drain on your mental state. So then it becomes this battle like, okay, but then I'm not staying dedicated to certain things. But then what's the alternative? You do stay dedicated and then years of your life go by and you don't enjoy it and you don't go do the things you want to do. And so it's always like a constant battle, but I really do appreciate the people that are still sub to me. And there will be times that I take breaks, but I'm not going to sit there and, you know, everyone knows that you go through those things. Like you deal with dealing with like, you know, you have to take breaks from your mental state and whatever, whatever. I'm not going to say that all the time, but that is what's happening. Cause I don't, I also don't like having like pity parties for myself. I'm not saying that everyone who says their truth is having a pity party, but I don't like to constantly mention it cause I don't want people to feel sorry for me. But like, you know, you do deal with a lot of like mental things and shit. And, and just because I don't say it all the time, that doesn't mean I'm not dealing with it all the time. Does that make sense? So sometimes if I'm ghost, I seem to be all happy. That doesn't mean that like I'm not going through shit. It just is like I'm not vocalizing it all the time. You know what I mean? Anyway, my point is, is hi breezy. <laughs> I know, thanks. <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> my point is, is that I still really appreciate the support because ultimately, in the end, if I didn't have supporters and I didn't have subs and I wasn't able to monetize what I do, I wouldn't be here doing this with you guys because it's just life, that's how life is. You need to pay the bills, you need to focus, you need to eat, etc. So, you know, it's always a struggle, it's always hard for me. And then people are like, oh, we well, can do like IRL traveling streams, but right now you can't because of the pandemic. And even when I could, I didn't have the funds enough to get like a backpack and do it correctly because then when I tried to, it would always be like laggy or whatever. So there's always like issues, you know what I mean? But, <laughs> Yeah, it is, it is good to do things for you, but all, you know, it's just, it's, it's, it's constant, it's constant. <laughs> and then it's like, okay, keep up with all the things, like stay active in your Discord and fucking stay on Twitch and constantly be in contact with your friends and constantly be in contact with your parents and your family and constantly like work on yourself and better yourself and fucking try to meditate and do yoga, but you know, don't take too much time for yourself or else you're not working on yourself enough and it's just like, too much, too much shit, just too much fucking things. Too many things, too many things. <laughs> so, so, yes, my, my point is, is that it's hard to grow all the time when you're, you know, you have, in your year, you take some time off to be a person. Um, it's hard to be consistent and stuff and grow, but I don't know, at the end of the day, like, I'm happy with my life and how things are. And I love to grow, but I don't also, I don't want to be a slave to anything, even if it's streaming. I don't want to be a slave to it because if I am, then it's a job and it's, I'm not having fun anymore. I'm not enjoying what I do. And you, you lose that spark, you know, to do anything it's fun. <laughs> Breezy, what is good? Why are you not here right now doing yoga with me? Hello? Where, where are you at? Where are you at? 
Hello, vegan. How are you, baby? And yes, Asset, I agree. Thank you guys for coming to my TED Talk. I'm not always such a vocal person. Sometimes I'm vocal about things, sometimes I'm not. Sometimes I get in these modes where I just spill everything, like I'm a drunk person. I'm not, I'm not drunk, I'm just meant like, like, you know, the drunk girl at the bar that talks too much about their life. <sighs> Depends. You're at the apartment with no Wi-Fi, just chilling. Damn, they shutting the lights off on you already, huh? They're like, get the fuck out. They're like, fucking leave. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> I am also not drunk. <laughs> I am casually enjoying my wine for my Lord Kirk mug. Can't even shoot the shit without getting yikes anymore. Oh, no. Uh, Call of Duty has a very dry sense of humor, and he says things that... And he's not being mean, is what I mean. Oh my god, thank you! Yeah, I can't take credit for all of them. A lot of them are barbs. Um, what are the odds we get plastered tonight and watch Parent Trap? What? Why? No, I have things to do, Boo Boo. I have a, okay, so I'm really stoked. I have a, I have a giveaway that I'm a part of tomorrow, dropping um, with Gleba TV, and it's going to be like a huge, like, follow Miss Angelique and these other five participants to get added to the giveaway, and... I'm, I'm, I'm hoping for a lot of in, a, a big influx, and so I need to get all my shit in order tonight, because tomorrow is D-Day, and I need to be, like, ready for that, you know, if it happens. So, I have to clean up my entire Instagram tonight, and I'm redoing my entire Facebook like page, and I fucking hate Facebook, but it's the only place that I'm going to be able to put all the shit that I do without oversaturating my other social media. So... Yeah, I have to do that tonight, and I might be up until 6 a.m., but I'm okay with that. I gotta do it. Gotta do it, gotta do it, gotta do it. So then with tomorrow, I can... Actually, no, tomorrow I can't either, because tomorrow I'm going over John Bourne's in the morning, because we're gonna do this cool body painting TikTok. And then I gotta come back, and then I gotta stream, and then we have some movie night, and then... I think... Wait, hang on a minute. I think I... Actually, where's my list? Excuse me. I will tell you right now what I'm doing tomorrow. I have a notepad because sometimes I forget. So let's see. Um, okay, Thursday. Okay. Um, can we go to John's in the morning? Then, oh yeah, then I have a pole session. I have a train, I'm training my pole session. So John's to do that, training my pole session. Then I gotta go to Ulta Walgreens to run some errands. Um, I need to go send out some stuff in my PO box, then I gotta come back, I gotta take a shower, I gotta do stream, I gotta do some movie night, and then I'll be free. I do. Every day I write things down I have to do in my little notepad, because if I don't, then I won't be able to remember. <laughs> there's so many things. Do you see that? There's just so many. Do you see this? Do you see that? Does anybody see that? It's a lot. This is, this is a lot of things in a week. That's a lot of fucking things to do in a week, okay? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I also like, I also just like, okay, now you got me vamping. I enjoy taking the time sometimes to explain this to you, but I don't like being repetitive. I don't feel the need to always explain myself. I don't mean that in a bitchy way. I just mean like, I don't like to over talk about myself. I think it's really fucking cringy. And so I don't like today, I'll be like, look at all these things in a list. And then you'll never hear me mention the list again, because I don't like over talking about myself. It's super cringy to me. Um, and again, the explaining thing. And sometimes people take that as like, I'm being too closed off or whatever, but it's, it's just my personal preference. It's nothing bad, it's just me being me. Imagine having a schedule. <laughs> I understand you, I feel that way sometimes. But then it's hard because people expect that certain different level from someone that's, and whatever, it doesn't matter. My point is, is that, yeah. I just like to do, I don't like to talk about things a lot of the time. Unless I want to talk about it. I don't know what this is, it's not World of Warcraft anymore, but I'm vibing. It's called volcanic, volcanic, 
I don't know, but I really like it. I'm down. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Was she? We love her. Yeah, I just like to do things. I don't know. I like to, and all, and everything else that, and everything else that also grows people. Like I don't know. I feel like a, a lot of people that get that kind of like instant growth of fame on Twitch are very much involved with like putting their two cents in all the drama and getting involved with all the bigger content creators and whether that's for the right or wrong reasons or whatever. I don't know. Like any friendship I make through Twitch, I want to be genuine. I don't want it to be anything else than genuine. Does that make sense? Just doing is way better than just, yeah, exactly. Yeah, that too. And so I see a lot of people on the rise always, and I see what they're doing, and I'm so like, <laughs> mastermind. I'm like, I know what you're doing. I know exactly what you're doing. So I grew up in that world, like, especially out here in LA. I, I, I literally started working in LA for this thing called Arsenic, which now is a dinosaur. Nobody cares or knows what it is anymore. But Arsenic Magazine was a huge deal in 2014 when I first moved out here. And I was shoved into that world of like, every fucking person stepping on each other and doing different things to get to where they are and using people and I was like what the fuck and so now I'm like above that shit and I just see it I don't mean that in a nasty way I just meant like I, I observe these things because I know what's happening and I can see everybody's like plays and moves and what they're doing and how they're trying to do it and what their fucking goals are and I feel like I see it all and I get that and that's cool do you that's not what I want to do I'm not about it but I observe it, and it seems to be what a lot of people like, and so good for them too. That's about it. <sighs> Not. Also, anyone want to sue Walgreens with me? <laughs> Solicited has been drinking. Excuse me. There's one in the world at the corner of Happy and Healthy. <laughs> There's a fake road sign called Happy and Healthy. Whenever you go to the pick up your vitamins. They do have it, it does exist. It's just not on any actual road in America. <laughs> so, you know. Okay. To finish what we're doing. Dude, I feel so hungry. All right, to finish up with our yoga, what we're going to do is flip on our backs, okay? To finish it up. together in an open diamond. <laughs> oh, dude, thank you. <laughs> I don't always spit facts, but when I do, I can't shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, that makes me happy. I want to get back into this and get like a solid core group doing this every Wednesday again. And now it will 100% be every Wednesday. And again, I'm sorry that I fell off with that. It's just... I just, just TBH, I didn't fucking like to do it without my mirror. I really like my mirror. I like it for you guys also to see different angles. I like it for me, it motivates me. I like my space better with it, so sorry about it. But now that I am back doing it, it will be consistently every Wednesdays and I will be posting in the Discord yoga moves and poses and pictures and whatever again. And I encourage you all to share your shit there too if you wanna have any progress or whatever. So. We need the facts fitting less drama. Yeah, everybody says that, but then they like it. It's like watching a train wreck. Like, you hate to see it, but everyone stays watching it. It's just what it is. It's just how the world is. Okay, arms up all the way. Stretch up high. And breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Knees together, off to the left side. Twist your arms to the right. Anyway, look to the right. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
such. I have a infinity, oh god yeah, please ignore that, it's terrible, it's getting covered up entirely soon, very soon. <laughs> Okay, everybody lay corpse pose. I can never fucking say the word corpse now without thinking of corpse as in. Everybody lay corpse pose, um, which is just lay down, basically. Um, I got it with an X, and I'm gonna cover it. <laughs> Dude, I'm very excited that you're gonna start it then. Yeah, it's amazing. Hi, Slimy again. Slimy Snowy. Makes me think about slushies. All right, while we're laying in corpse pose, I'm gonna do that DMT breathing thing again. I'm not gonna say it out loud, but if you guys wanna follow along, deeply remember deep. In through your nose, out through your nose. In through your nose, out through your mouth. In through your mouth, out through your mouth. Repeat, get quicker at each time, but deep breaths, fill up your belly. Exhale, bring it into your spine, okay? I'm gonna do it myself while we're laying here a few times really quickly and um, hopefully we get to feel tingly and get weird, okay? Ready? Okay. etc 
Um, we have cat jam and shit now, so get excited. <laughs> uh, what else? What else? What else? What else? Yeah, namaste. Thank you for joining me. Um, thank you to everybody who followed, who cheered, who subbed, resubbed. Um, and I will see you guys tomorrow. And the best nods ever, ever, ever. And my two new most from Call of Duty. Um, and the best nods ever, ever. Call of Duty, Raisa, Almighty, Paul, Mango. Call of Duty, Raisa, Almighty, Mango, Paul. So which one? Okay. I'm gonna run into the other room. Um, enjoy my map while I run and exit the stream. But thanks, guys. Have a nice night.